as you see in the title, I have 30 days to program Unity 2D racing game with zero experience. I have my boss who set me this project. His current confidence is, as you can see above, like in the medium level. Progress, again, as you can see above, is <laughs> not much, uh, to be honest, zero percent. So I really need to push to complete this project. So yeah, please enjoy my journey. Um, hopefully you can learn something from it and yeah, let's begin. Yeah, uh, so these are some tutorials I found for now. Uh, don't worry, they will all be in the description, but let me just show you. I found this guy, Charger Games, who throws some tutorial on 2D racing games. And uh, this is like his playlist, 32 videos, uh, like Android slash PC game. I, I'm only aiming for a PC game, that's what my boss told me, but I can try both. So yeah, basically small update. Uh, I'm not sure what to do here. I'm doing this project for some reason, maybe it's sold or something like that, but I don't have what they have. And I can't really, you know, navigate to what they are doing. And now I'm in a small problem. So, yeah, if I can't, uh, I will try to go to that YouTube video. If that doesn't work, uh, I'm afraid I need to click emergency alert or something. But hopefully, fingers crossed that guy can explain me what to do. So, yeah, hello again. I want just to inform you we are using another program, it's called Inkscape, I found it again through the video tutorial, here I made my road, it's like V for Vesic, you can see him on the screen, uh, so this is the my roadmap and yeah, let's move on. Okay, welcome back, I just want to tell you, as you saw from the previous scrape, I was happy, I debugged something. <laughs> And now finally our thing moves, yeah, Wait just a moment, you can see it moves actually, so one step has been completed, it is actually looking good, and we will see how it develops slowly, so let's go. Let's go! Okay, just a review for today, we actually made pretty good progress, thank god for that YouTuber, I, I, I thank you, I thank you, I put your link in the description. I forgot your name, but thank you very much. Anyways, we made the map, we made the car, I mean, we didn't make the car, we will do it later. We made the movement, we made the map move, we restricted the map, so yeah, basically, what we completed today. We started the project, we made the map, like on the, uh, of the game, then we made the car move, we made the map move and finally we made the car not go outside of the map yeah that's pretty much it okay see you tomorrow good night <laughs>
we set them to spawn they're spawning after 0 0.5 seconds we made good progress the enemies are now here but they aren't doing anything really there is no game over not this not that but we still made good progress and for now i'm feeling good i i think also i will check the boss is feeling better uh, and the overall progress will be here up in the screen i don't know what is it now but by the point I edit this video, I will know. So thank you for this and good night. See you tomorrow. New update. Now our car gets destroyed when hit by enemy car. You can see here I'm dodging, but when I got hit, you notice how it got destroyed. I can replay. The car is now getting destroyed, look more clearly, it just disappears, I mean, it should show game over, it should have sound effect music, but this is good upgrade. Now, when my car hits the enemy car, when it hits the opponent, when it hits the obstacle, it gets destroyed, so that's, that's good. <laughs> Okay, hello, just to review this day, we uh, actually made our car get destroyed when get uh, getting hit by the object, which is good, we want that, and we also applied that when the uh, opponent's car, the obstacle uh, gets off screen, it gets destroyed, because we don't want the game to freeze, because it would be too much for the game to process, so we want to limit that, I did that today, not much, not like last two days, but... I have some things to do today. Uh, no, I don't really feel like it. Uh, and but I at least wanted to do this. The overall progress is what you can see here above. I don't know how much we will see. I don't know currently. You know the screen and uh, the boss's confidence. Again, I don't want to show it now. We will have a meeting soon and then I will tell you his confidence. So see you tomorrow. It's day still here, but I will say good night. Now everything is moving a bit faster. I change a bit of speed. Some things are moving a bit slower. The track is faster. I just wanted to add the the dy dynamic to this game make it like more speed more ra uh, rapid uh, you know just to make it uh, more fun today i had some more things to do so i couldn't focus too much on this project but i just sped uh, uh, added speed more to the game made uh, the game more dynamic in general didn't take much time but just to do something just to do at least little change today at least something and then uh, in the coming days i will try to do more and also the update for today is that i'm meeting boss about my boss on friday which is four days from now so i want to continue working on it so he has a good impression okay good night see you tomorrow Now you can see the game is spawning random cars, there are now multiple cars being spawned, random, making a variety in this game, making it a little bit more interesting, a little bit more dramatic, you know, here I'm now dodging orange, red, this, that, and yeah, that's about it. As you saw from the last clip, now in, I added multiple cars, like an array that will randomly generate multiple very models of cars to make it a little bit more you know interesting the game again these are not my models i will try to change that towards the end of the pro project for now they're from google just download it but still it gives the variety to game it looks more interesting with different cars uh, so yeah that's about it for today good night and see you tomorrow Okay, just an update about Unity. Uh, now I will draw some plan for other four levels of my game. Because and soon, very very soon, we have a programmer coming. So I want, because I will be only able to complete level one, 
I will draw the remaining levels, a sketch of it now, so... Yeah, I forgot to mention I had a meeting with the boss, with the main boss, the guy who organizes all of these things and uh, he recommended me to make 5 levels and level 5 to be some kind of a boss fight which I'll of course like his idea. He is confident as you can see up here, he, he had good confidence and now it's basically on me to use his ideas and continue to work hard and it should be good so the pause button doesn't really work uh, as you can see i'm trying to click it no 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 doesn't work not good uh, it's all well you you can see i selected all the right things i don't know i don't know what's the issue i'm trying to find it out somehow He's bloody missed it! What a prat! What a prat! Phil Jones! It was bloody written in the stars! So basically today I tried to add the pause button. It didn't really work. Not good. Not good. I, I, don't, I don't know how to do it. I, I, I did everything I said. Every, I tried the tutorials, different tutorials, this, that. Doesn't work. I don't know. But it's getting late. I should probably sleep so yeah I'll we'll try tomorrow to do it maybe ask for some help I don't know this this can be an issue this can be an issue good night and see you tomorrow and soon very very soon we have a programmer coming so Okay, pause is working, as you can see we click and it stops the game, this is very good, it stops the game when I click it, very good. Basically now uh, we have this, uh, basically now we have this beautiful menu and if you please play, it plays, the game actually plays, again pause, words, the things are working, we are back, back in town, the things are working, this is very good, very good. Okay, so basically now we added, okay, so basically now we added play button, menu button, so if you see when I die, it stops and I click play again, it plays again, it shows all the time, I will fix that tomorrow, it only shows when I actually die, then you can also go menu but for some reason it has some error i will try to fix this okay so the review for today we actually did quite a bit we added the menu the main menu we added the score we did added a quit so the game over not quit so we have a game even more functional now you have a score you have a main menu uh, it is going good tomorrow the programmer comes uh, you will see that very soon probably in your video in about 30 seconds uh, so yeah good night and tomorrow is a big day Okay, so to resume for today, we made the game over menu. It works now, but the score doesn't work because of the menu and that. But hopefully we will fix it tomorrow. Uh, the program... I heard uh, some new programmers are trying to compete with me with this game. Ah! It's 
my turn now. No, mine! I remade the texture for the Vestige car and added the gold bridge to the game. You prats! You bloody prats! So we're now testing if he works. Let's see that. Alright, I'm in the game. Oh, there's his gold bridge. Well, he works very good. The speed is great and he's not broken anymore. Good job, Laura. Hello. It's a pleasure to see you. It's a pleasure to be here. I want to talk about uh, my new game, Vesic Racer, about the ideas around it and what would you do in my opinion, in my case, a level 5 boss fight, Okay. this will be Wuchit's tank, he will launch some cars and some different objects, Vesic Racer, he will be he will be here and he will try to dodge it and if he survives this 120 seconds, he will beat the game so uh, d would you like to add something what is this would you change something would you do a different time limit how would you make this harder how would you make it feel like a boss level this idea is very interesting actually you know it's related a little bit to politics but then again it's really fun i think uh, i like your approach uh, it is simple it will be eye candy it will be fun I can see here that you, the car you're driving and the guy inside, it's really, really, I don't know, it's quite funny. Uh, I wouldn't change, honestly, anything, maybe in some future versions that uh, uh, you are able maybe to survive several impacts, you know, with the other cars or something when you're driving them. So it's like uh, extension of this current version. Mm -hmm. So the, the, the game lasts longer. Would you like add maybe for final level or for some level maybe if you catch a car somewhere on the game you have a additional health so it, uh, the car can hit you twice and then you die. Something like this or maybe in even further versions you can maybe add some upgrades and something so you can survive three impacts, four impacts. Ah, I see. Like now you drive Lamborghini, you know, but later uh, actually, Mr. Vesic is driving a, a Lamborghini. You can give him some something, you know, even stronger, faster. Or oh, maybe. Some big SUV, 600, you know, horsepower, ah, like which the... hits everything. You know, ah, in, like in reality, what is happening over there. But ah, like, really, the, yeah. like star in the Mario Kart, when you get yeah. the star and you just... When you're a top-class politician, then you can go ah. on this graphics. I, I'm, I cannot show this to the audience, but this is perfect, you know. They need to wait for the release. Yes, of course. Now, yeah, yeah. I know, only we better testers see this, this creativity. Yeah. Oh, only, only the main developer that we saw today. We can even bring, uh, just a moment, I will bring main my, designer. my main leading designer. Hello, Mr. Wilkins. Hello. Okay. Maybe you can continue. Yes, yes, <laughs> we will continue this. this. Thank you, Mr. Vukovic. Main idea behind these designs of Mr. Vucic, Mr. Vesic and Mr. Goldbridge. Well, for Mr. Vucic, I really just had an inspiration from a game I played on my mobile phone and I thought it was just sorry I can't show it you will see it in a final product and for the message the plot I thought I don't know the gold bridge is epic it's yeah, the best of course. fire in the eyes yeah, he's yeah. angry yeah you can see in his face he's, a he's furious. very mad Thank you very much for the development. Thank you, you will be credited in the game. Thank you. Okay, thank Goodbye. you. Bye. Goodbye. Uh, for everyone enjoying this podcast, for full podcast, pay 
60 dollars on the link below below thank you this is my song and no one can take it away it's been so long but now you're here Hello, now you can see uh, that we don't see game over screen from the start of the game which is good so the game is much more playable and when I die then the screen appears and then I can choose menu for example play and do it all over again. Okay, hello, I'm here back to say what we did today. So basically only thing that we did today is remove the game over key, I mean the game over title the game over screen when until you actually get the game over so it doesn't interrupt the game which is good uh, the thing i want to add tomorrow is probably some sounds into the game something like that like acceleration sound break sound to make it more realistic and yeah good night see you tomorrow okay basically now we added some sound and some music into the game we can see the acceleration sound effect and some background music to make the game more dynamic and uh, more interesting yeah hello just to recap what i did today today again not too much but uh, important to remain consistent today i added sounds into my game as you saw and some music so the game looks a little bit more dynamic we will continue to add some sounds tomorrow maybe some break sounds some different sounds to make it even better but for now we have some base of sounds and when we add all of them it will make uh, this game very good Vestige would approve it so see you again good night and see you tomorrow so basically today we made it a little bit more you know compact a little bit more organized we added this audio manager so later on uh, we don't make a mess when we add more sounds maybe to the game for now uh, we added this timer the displays i want it doesn't stop that's the problem the timer doesn't stop if i fail the level which can create confusion I will try to do that level uh, error to complete it and I also want to make menu button appear when I complete level one in order to navigate to the next level but we can see uh, it's improving we get some objectives and again and uh, step by step we are moving forward which is important okay hello just to say what I did today review Basically, we organized audio manager so we can add some additional audio rate later like breaks uh, The acceleration so on and so forth if we want to add we will see but uh, I made audio manager So it will be easier for that option I also changed from score to timer for now the timer almost works, but with a few fixes tomorrow uh, I think it will be very good very good option. So my game first uh, i wanted to do it like an arcade game now i changed to make it like complete all levels basically that is now the game good night see you tomorrow basically we added some menu music and uh, the menu button after you win a game after you win a level you can see some menu music a little bit retro maybe some people will be familiar with this one probably not and then you can play <laughs> We have a menu button, so when you click again, this is going to complete, and later then you will be able to select a new level. So already we are improving the game, and it's looking good. Just to tell what we did today, so basically I added some music for the menu, very good to make it more interesting. Tomorrow I will probably try to create level two and maybe make another menu i mean when you click the menu there is a menu which shows you all the five levels there will be on the game probably on the screen you will see what i mean and then 
like you can select which level you want to play uh, but it is recommended of course to start from level one yeah <laughs> and uh, yeah next level uh, it will be interesting you will see I just call my leading designer you remember the one which came here with the computer and designed some characters he, he will design another character which will be very interesting for this game he just agreed on it uh, I also added the menu button so when you beat the level you can actually go uh, to menu and play the next level and there will also be next level button but when I create the next level so we are improving we are progressing and the game is starting to look like a proper game good night level 2 as you can see yeah <laughs> We have level 2 that's important, uh, level 1 was Goldbridge standard level, this is Vasco Jabata level and I will think what will I make level 3, so every level it will have its special theme, this one is let's say Bulgaria. Ok basically just to say what I did today, I made a level 2, basically created a new track like with Bulgaria flags as you saw. Uh, my colleague created the car, Vasco Jabata car, you can see it here, no, pardon me, here, 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 you can see it here, sorry, <laughs> uh, also I created, um, I put the music, I like made some changes that are in order for game to work, and yeah, now we have level 2, tomorrow I will probably like make a main menu where you can select level 1, level 2, level 3, level 4, level 5, and then of course later create level 3, level 4, level 5 at the end like make, make it also for Android. So for now we are doing good. Thank you. Good night. Let me show you how the game looks for now. That's it Racer. You saw this already. This part is already clear, famous, whatever. But now click play. Look, now we have a main menu. Uh, the rules, things I uh, need to add, this is like the final, 5th level, 3rd and 4th level don't exist, but let's go, for example, 2nd level, you close up the 2nd level, you play the 2nd level, the keys on computer and uh, uh, like your finger on the phone, so I will make that, and yeah, we will do that, I like it for now, pretty good, good music in the background, we did this today, good progress, tomorrow uh, I will try, I need to fix an issue with time bar and I will try to develop level 3 slowly, so yeah. Okay people, today we made level selector, uh, up there you can see the progress and now the boss is confident, I think we are doing pretty well, yeah. Uh, hopefully in the future we won't face any errors, today it was pretty straightforward changing something in code in UI manager this that but to make all buttons work to design on, on Filmora I designed the level selector image the texture which is used for of course people to select their level which they want to play uh, as I said before time bar needs to get fixed I will try to fix that tomorrow but overall progress is going doing good and uh, I will think about what I want to do for level 3. So thank you for now, goodbye. Now the timer issue doesn't exist as you can see. When I see the car, the timer stops. It works now. Now you can't cheat with waiting the time to pass to go to the next level, you actually need to complete it. So that issue is now gone and uh, we continue improving the game. Okay, just to mention what we did today, as you saw we fixed the timer, really that's what we done today. Not bad, not bad. Um, now I can continue developing the third level. Uh, I will not tell you what is the third level today. I know I have the idea in my head, but uh, I will let you see it. Sorry, sorry. Uh, anyways, good night. Now I wanted to show you. Now when you play the game, we have a new part. Okay, we know this stuff. Click play. Click rules. 
And now we have the rules. Uh, basically, to see how you move on phone and on a computer, uh, what is the purpose, the other cards that did survive the timer, and after clicking play, click pause button to play. So you need to click play button and pause button to play just to explain some things to the player so he understands the game better and then he clicks this button and he goes back to main menu and then from here he can play today i just added this tomorrow i will focus on making level 3 but this is some additional thing that can help the players so i think we did good today today i made the rules rules like rules picture added it into the game so if person like wants to play below in the level section rules they can they can see what is the game about and then play it which is good you want people to understand what they're going on so yeah we have that now and we are improving tomorrow level three and yeah overall progress very good on friday so in three days from now four actually four three and a half i'm meeting with the boss so we will see what he thinks uh, i will present him with the game he will see it so it it should be fun hello uh, i need to tell you that uh, we got the uh, new level let me show you uh, in the music everything you will see play and then you go level three Turkey style. Hear the music. Okay, it's looking good. You can see the back of the But yeah, good progress today. We have three levels. Fifth level is I have the song, I have the main character. I just need to think more about level four. But yeah, it's going good. Okay, so today we basically just, you know, made level 4, we created a road, a car, and simply just duplicated the last level, changed some bits and pieces and got level 3. Uh, we didn't make level 4, we made level 3, so I'm happy, this is our overall progress above. Boss is confident, I won't tell you now, on Friday we, uh, that is in two days we have, uh, no actually, yeah, two full days we have uh a meeting with him i will try to do level four until then and maybe a cheeky level five maybe possible if i don't have uh, idea for level four until tomorrow i will do level five i will see doesn't matter anyways good job today see you tomorrow hello so basically we created level four As you can see we click play level four we have crazy Romanian train that's level four basically <laughs> tell you what I did today we created level four I mean not I mean me but you know you still have an impact you're watching this uh, yeah, we created level 4, we are towards the end of the game, we just need the boss fight level to complete, we already have a car for that, I need to create a track for that though. So yeah, we created this railway track, this train, this uh, with this Moldavian band, hey ho, let's go, folklore, rock and roll, that, it's fun, it's fun, and uh, the game is going well, uh, I'm happy, this is the overall development. And yeah, we will see uh, in two days, I mean one full day and then I meet with the boss. So we will see what the boss says. We are closing on the deadline. But I think we, we shouldn't have problems doing, that, uh, doing this project before deadline. So this is good. Good night. Made the final level, level 5, you can see now. We click play. Oh, wait, I first need to click this, sorry. Now we click play. And then we click this large button. And then we so You can hear music is very stylish. <laughs> Anyways, that's the level and yeah, we will talk more specific later.
Okay, hello. So as you saw from the previous clip, today we made the level 5 boss level. I had some issues, some struggles, because the Vucic guy didn't spawn. Only He spawned only on the right side, not on the left, and then I was raging this dead. But thankfully, after many wrong attempts, this dead, delete, start over, don't save, blah blah blah, we managed to make this level. We have level 5. Tomorrow we need to present it to the big boss. We will of course see what the big boss says. We will see. This is the overall progress. I mean it's around what 95%. We are almost done. We just need to uh, add lock. So you know when you get in uh, the video. When you get in the video. What? When you get in the first level you can only play first level. And until you can't beat him you can't play second level. And so on and so on. It is locked until you beat the actual level. So yeah, we will try to do this. But for now, I'm very satisfied. Okay, good night. So anyways, we added this little cool function. First, if you go to level selection, look at this. Uh, you, you just start playing the game, right? You can't play level 2, level 4, level 5. Only level 1. And then, you need to beat it. And then, this happens. What happens next will shock you. You like play, play. Uh, anyways, it works. I think, yeah. So, after some work, I was able to fix this issue. I finally completed my game. I still didn't put it into the App Store. But I will do this later. For now, I made the lock screen so you can't play level 5 before completing levels such as level 1, 2, 3 and 4. Now I added also a button that after defeating level 1 it transforms you to level 2. Same applies for level 3 and level 4 and level 2. So yeah, I'm quite pleased we finally finished making the bloody game. Okay, bye. Okay, basically, this is the end of the journey for the project. Of course, I will put it in the App Store, upload this video, but this isn't the real part. As you can see, 100% done, complete, and boss happiness is... Uh, I mean, I need to present him the game in a few days, so I can't tell you that right now. I can tell you after the meeting, but I think he will be pleased. As you said, seen at the previous clip, we added menu, everything is looking good, the levels are looking good, it was a great journey, the game is much different than I what I initially thought, but for the better. I like the game pretty much, and hopefully uh, I will find some way to upload it somewhere so you have a chance to play it. Thank you for supporting me on this journey, and goodbye and look on the final skit of the video. Time to check Gmail. I don't know, it's quite fun. And now the end is near And so I face the final curtain Bait.